So today is March the 17th and uh, we're back here at the Flak Panzer Restoration Project with Rob. Rob, can you tell us what's going on today? Well today primarily we're taking the road wheels off and uh, it's not too bad a job. Usually when we're taking stuff apart in this tank they're so rusty that the bolts are a heck of a heck of a time getting them apart. However, because there's so much grease on these wheels, uh, the, the uh, bolts and stuff are actually quite easy to take off. Basically what we have to do, we start off with the grease cover on the outside and it's put on with six bolts with lock, lock washers on it. So once we bend the lock washers and remove the six bolts, then we actually remove the outer grease seal. And then inside there you'll, we find a crenellated nut, as you can see on the end of these ones here, and that's, on, that's also locked on with a lock washer behind. Then we have to, where it's bent over in the, in the grooves of the uh, nut, we end up straightening, straightening that out and then we can actually get, then get the uh, nut turning and get it to come off the, the spindle. Once we've done that, then we can slide the wheel off using a, a pallet truck because uh, the wheels are quite a, quite a weight actually. And uh, we can slide the wheels off, then we, uh, then we end up putting the nut back on again to protect the threads so that we don't damage the threads when the wheels are off. But basically that's what we're doing today. We've got the other side completely done already and we're just picking away at the left side now. Okay. So. Well, we'll come back to find you later. Excellent. Thank you. So this is the usual bit where we cap off the day. Back with Rob again. Rob, the entire side of the vehicle is uh, completely different. Can you tell me what happened? Well, today after we, uh, we got the road wheels off, then we decided to take off some of the uh, main suspension parts. And you can see these squares here with the holes. That's where they were mounted. Uh, each each uh, suspension part is held with 22 bolts, 12 from underneath and 10 from the side. Uh, obviously they didn't want that to fall off in combat. The front one, you can see a lot more corrosion. Uh, it was a lot harder to get off. We had to use the torches to, uh, to remove some of the bolts. Uh, but fortunately then the last three were a lot better and using an impact wrench we were able to get the, the bolts out. We had to be very careful. Uh, we kind of got a system where we removed the 12 bolts from underneath first, and then uh, su suspending, the, uh, suspending the suspension part because it's probably 500 pounds, making sure it was safe. Then we removed the other 10 bolts on the side, and then we were able to tuck it away and, and store it over there for uh, even more disassembly later. But we've got one side done, and the next time we come, I think we will probably attack the four on the other side and get those off. And that's right. what we did today, a lot of work. Right, sounds good. Thanks a lot for your time. See Thank you. Guys, you. Uh, in two weeks. Excellent.